In this video, we will guide you through the first steps of using Motic Pantera's embedded software of the Pantera Cloud Microscope, offering a quick overview of its key functions and tools. The Pantera Cloud features a SmartCam digital hat that together with its imaging on-device system allows you to capture full HD images and videos instantly by simply connecting it to a screen without need for a computer. At the back of the microscope, we have an HDMI port allowing seamless connection to an external screen for real-time viewing. An Ethernet port that enables network connectivity via cable, perfect for data transfer and remote access. And additionally, there are two USB ports which can be used to connect external devices such as a mouse, keyboard or a USB stick for image storage, making the microscope even more user-friendly and adaptable to various tasks. Make sure that the microscope is turned off. Next, connect HDMI to a screen and turn on the microscope. Now we are ready to use the Pantera Cloud embedded onboard software. The software features an intuitive interface organized into three menu sections. On the right side of the menu, we can find some essential functions and basic tools. We can capture images or record videos directly from the screen. All the files will appear in the gallery below. Capture images or recording videos can be also done by pressing the microscope light intensity knob. The measurement tools include different shapes, like square, angle measurement. We can also add some text with the digital keyboard, change color, undo, redo function, and a rest button. Live view and image gallery menus allow us to switch between viewing in the live feed from the camera or accessing the gallery, where we can choose the capture, make some measurement, change or add some text, make a report, change the ubication of our file in a new folder, or delete the capture. The Pantera onboard software comes pre-configured from factory, so there is no need to modify or adjust anything manually. In the basic adjustment menu, we can adjust some basic configuration, like brightness, saturation, we can flip the image, add some skull cross, skull bar option. All also, we have the advanced menu, where we can change the sharpness, make the wall balance, and back to the basic menu, we have the configuration of the lenses, where they came pre-calibrated, and when we switch from one to another, the software automatically detects it. In the advanced settings, we have some prominent options, like possibility to enable or disable the remote control of the properties of the live view, where users cannot modify the live image of the microscope. We can link our Dropbox personal account. And for more information, remember that we have a special video how to link the Dropbox to Pantera Cloud. And Wi-Fi settings options where we can choose a network that you prefer. For educational settings, you can also work on your mobile devices via Wi-Fi by downloading our free Pantera app. Well, as you can see, getting started with our Pantera Cloud's onboard software is really easy and intuitive. Thanks for watching this video.